a fierce showdown with the Saiyans, the Earth was safe once again. But that safety came at a hefty price. The Dragon Balls, the only hope of bringing back those who had lost their lives, were gone. Thanks to what Vegeta said, however, Gohan and the others learned of more Dragon Balls on Kami's homeworld, planet Namek. After they had found Kami's old spaceship, Gohan and the others made preparations for their long, arduous trip to Namek. I'd better head to Capsule Corporation to find out. Holding out for hope on planet Namek. Maybe... Maybe the spaceship's ready for takeoff. She wanted to talk to me specifically. I'm not sure I'll be of much help, though. What's up guys, welcome to the first part of the second saga in uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. This is Vlad and I'm going to be your guide for this story mission. As you can see, the moment you start the second saga in the video game, you'll be able to also play a sub story. Make sure you complete it and only then focus on uh, on the actual uh, story as you can see there are uh, there are additional uh, sub stories as well you'll have to complete all of them before uh, before uh, visiting Bulma So now let's travel to West City and uh, and find Bulma. Here she is. She's in front of uh, Capsule Corporation. Notice that uh, I have cleared all sub stories before moving uh, forward with this uh, with this main story just the person i was looking for huh what's up bulma we're gearing up to go to namek right i'm working on the spaceship that's gonna get us there but i'm short on parts oh bummer with goku in the hospital practically mummified in bandages you're the only one left for the job Oh, no problem, Bulma. Leave it to me. That's the spirit. Here's what I need. Okay, so we need to find Hover it more molastion. Think you can handle that? Okay, I don't know what these uh, these materials are. Right. So let's see where these materials are. So 
so I guess we need to head north. And uh, exit the, the city. Let's check the map again. Okay, so you can see that on the minimap we have three three circles which indicate the areas we'll need to look. Sure, if this is the one, no, I don't think it is. I think I can handle this. This is one of them. Right? So we have the first one between these trees. I think I can handle this. The next one. Here I go. The next one is a battle against. These annoying robots. So here is another purple uh, purple orb found another one great near this bid rock and uh, and the pond remember that we used to to fish for uh, energetic fish here and the final one It's ro no, this is a uh, a D medal. Here it is. On this hill, there it is. Yay, I found it! This looks to be everything. I'd better get these to Bulma. So let's return to Bulma really fast to keep this video as short as possible. Remember that uh, this is the first episode of the second saga. I'm pretty excited about it actually. I enjoyed this game very very much. Talk about speedy service. Everything check out. <laughs> sure does. Great job. I'll have this spaceship up and running in no time. Thanks a bunch, Bulma. Okay, so we not, we've got another soul emblem, and we've got the development community board unlocked. Great, because I was waiting for this for quite 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 some time right now let's uh let's increase oh no this is a training 
Let's place some emblems over here. I believe I have Yes, I have some that I need to use this one for example Oh So here is the spaceship. The spaceship is complete and ready for takeoff. All right, Gohan, just let me know when you're ready to launch. We won't be back on Earth anytime soon, so make sure you've got it right. Okay, so it's time to check the, the journal to see So, the moment we decide to leave, this, uh, this episode ends. Make sure that before, uh, before, you, before you leave Earth, you complete all sub-stories. It's, uh, it's very important because I don't think you'll be able to, to finish them after the story. I'm not sure though, but uh, I don't think uh, you'll, uh, you'll be able to play them. So. So, you all set for the trip? Yes, we are. Okay, I'll just perform a few final checks and make my way over to Kame House. You go ahead and meet up with Krillin and the others. With their preparations for the journey to planet Nemec complete, everyone has gathered at Kame House. <laughs> What's with the hair, go on? My mom thought I should look more presentable. You know, when meeting an entire alien race for the first time. Ah, uh, okay. Man, your mom sure is strict. We're counting on you. Don't come back until you found those Dragon Balls. On it. Bye, Grandpa. Bye, Mom. Bye, Master Roshi. Write me every day, go on. Meanwhile, just as Bulma and the others left for planet Nemec, Vegeta, back and fully recovered from his fight on Earth, learned of his commander Frieza's absence. Frieza was on his way to planet Nemec with his most elite subordinates in tow. He was in search of the Dragon Balls that he learned of from Vegeta and the others on Earth. His goal? To wish for immortality. Vegeta hurriedly made his way to Nemec in an effort to catch Frieza and stop him. If Frieza is able to attain immortality, the universe is history. I'm not going to let that happen. Those Dragon Balls are mine! Meanwhile, 34 days after Bulma and the others left Earth, they finally arrived at their destination, Planet Namek. We did it! We actually made it to Planet Namek! Hmm, this place... Kinda reminds me of where Piccolo trained me. Back on no use waiting around. Let's find those Dragon Balls. Oh, hey, check this out! I'm picking something up. No doubt about it. It's a Dragon Ball. You're right. Woohoo! <laughs> All right. All right. We found we one. Found we one. found one. Huh? Krillin, do you feel that strong energy over there? Huh? Man, you're not kidding. It's massive, and it feels crazy strong. And there's something kind of evil about it, too. Uh, what's going on? There's nothing to freak out about. Besides, look at the reading I'm getting over there. The radar's picking up four Dragon Balls all in one spot. Uh, yeah, 
You're right. <laughs> it's probably just some Namekians. We got nothing to be afraid of. <laughs> right? <laughs> Lower your power level. They'll know we're here. Yeah. It's Vegeta. Looks like it's just him. I am not letting you get your filthy hands on those Dragon Balls, Frieza. Yeah! Bulma, let the others know what's going on, and then head back to Earth. Bulma, let the others know what's going on, then head back to Earth. Gohan, sound good to you? Y yeah. Uh, okay, I'll get a hold of Master Roshi and fill him in first. Once I'm back, I'll pick Goku up and bring him here. I should be back in about two months. Right. Two months. Hmm? Uh, what? Uh, another one? Hold the phone. What's another one of those things doing here? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what I want to know. We found it, Lord Frieza! Excellent work. Now only three remain out of my grasp. <laughs> Take care not to lose that, Dodoria. It seems Vegeta is looking for the Dragon Balls as well. Yes, sir! Uh, pardon me, Lord Frieza. Kui has just intercepted Vegeta. Has he? My, that was fast. In addition... Uh, the two large power sources from earlier have suddenly disappeared as well. I will make my way to their location and investigate. I should be able to identify them shortly. Very well, but I'm more concerned about ridding myself of that traitor Vegeta. What a shame. I didn't think him foolish enough to turn against me, let alone attempt to steal the Dragon Balls for himself. Kui should be on his way to dispose of Vegeta. Should be interesting. Those two have long hated each other. They are roughly equal in power, I believe. So I assume it'll take a fair bit of time. You're not going anywhere, Vegeta. I'm going to enjoy blowing you to pieces. Make sure to let Goku and the others know. Thanks. All right, I'm heading back to Earth now. Good luck, you two. I'll be back with Goku as fast as I can. Huh? Krillin! Someone's coming! Huh? Is it the Saiyan? No. It's not Vegeta. It's someone weaker. Probably a Namekian. It should be right around here. Huh? Look. What the hell is that? What? Oh, those aren't Namekians! They don't look like Namekians! Who the hell are they? Their power levels are a joke! They're nothing but trash! I guess it's just some Taurus, huh? Well, anyway, we got orders to annihilate everyone on the planet. It wouldn't be much fun if they got away. Sounds good to me. No! That's our ship! <laughs> Sucks to be them. Guess that we're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Okay, go on. Feel free to let loose your ghost. Right.
So one of them is already is already down, and here is the second one. This is a pretty short fight. Krillin also leveled up. Yeah. Hey, nice going, Gohan. Nice going. There's nothing nice about this. Uh, Lord Frieza, it seems like those two power sources from before may warrant more of our attention. They raised their power levels almost instantly, and then vanished after defeating two of our scouts. That is indeed strange. I highly doubt it's Vegeta's doing. Correct, my lord. It can't be Vegeta. The sources each have a power level of about 1,500. 1,500, is that right? Hardly anything worthy of our concern, wouldn't you say? They do seem rather unruly. If you happen upon these two, eliminate them. Let us leave Vegeta's destruction to Queen. <laughs> you hear that, Vegeta? That was a direct order from Lord Frieza. I finally get to kill you. Don't make me laugh, Queen. Do you actually think you can beat me? <laughs> Are you blind, Vegeta? Take a look at your scouter. You'll see my power level is leagues above yours. <laughs> <laughs> okay so let's check the the journal first to see to see our objectives and rewards oh actually this is still the the first episode This is still the first episode. There are no uh, no sub stories available, although we have uh, several enemy bases we can destroy. We won't deal with them right now. We'll focus on Kui. Actually, let's uh, let's destroy one of them. You know, just for fun. Easy prey. Let's see what what kind of rewards do we get? Force Commandos Vegeta definitely definitely is a great fighter Impressive. You actually held your own against the mighty Vegeta um, I'm going to to check if we can improve some of uh, some of his uh, skills Here, there isn't much much we can uh, we can upgrade right now. So let's uh, let's deal with uh, with quick. Not this way, huh?
seems yeah. that uh, oh he's up in the air so you have to <laughs> you must really to reach his location coming at me like this <laughs> you've lost your edge Vegeta you don't stand a chance against me with a power level like that <laughs> Don't be disappointed. You're in for a treat. You see, I've managed to learn a little new trick during my time on Earth. <laughs> like what? How to run away? Like how to control my power level. <laughs> no way. 90, 20, 21, 22,000. <laughs> wow. This is impressive. some sort of error but I set my scouter to Vegeta's coordinate and it's showing a reading of more than 22,000 did you say 22,000 that's an older model scouter isn't it here I'll get a more accurate reading with mine <laughs> impossible it can't be is my scouter broken but it's a newer model the readings up to 24,000 <laughs> Are you saying his power level is even beyond ours now? <laughs> Die! We're supposed to be equal in power! I'm both stronger than each battle that I fought! The most recent one on Earth pushed me to the brink of death! Okay, so indeed Vegeta is the most uh, powerful fighter up to this point, as you can see, he has some really, really powerful uh, strikes. Ah. Let's recharge our key for a bit. Man, this is prepare yourself. And so much for the fight with Kui. Vegeta is in indeed great. <laughs> Truly. Dirty fireworks. Vegeta's power level from before. That 24,000 reading, it was real. Oh, I don't believe it. He just took out Kui! I'm hardly surprised at this. How soon you forget, Vegeta is a highly experienced fighter in every right. Not to mention foolish. <laughs> he doesn't seem to know his error and so brazenly defy me. Lord Frieza, the scouter shows there are about ten Namekians in that direction. Very good. Let's hope they have what I'm looking for. The fifth Dragon Ball. Let's pay them a visit. So we've got Vegeta's uh, Soul Emblem, which I'm going to use in the Z Warrior community board. I, I hate to say it, but that's it. We're screwed. There's no way we can ever get back to Earth now. 
Paloma. Let's let's at least get away from this place. We're sitting ducks out here. We should try to find a place to hide. Maybe in a Namekian house or a cave or something. We'll try to figure something out. I'm I'm sure the Namekians can help us fix our ship, right? I wish I could be as optimistic as you two. Great, so let's check the journal. So I guess this uh, this ends the episode one once we find a hideout on Namek. Again, there are no sub stories and we cannot leave this planet yet. So really here we go. Right now, but I can't oh. give away my location. We'll try to to reach the marker on foot because obviously we cannot fight. Fly, but we can this jump over here. It looks like it'll do the trick. So, how long do we have to stay in a creepy place like that? Huh? Grillin, do you sense that power over there? Uh, yeah, I do. But it's not like the others from before. This time it might be Namekian. Huh? Hide! There's some strange energy headed this way. What are you doing, Bulma? Hide! Those guys we beat up earlier weren't alone! Huh? It's them! Do me a favor and check the dragon radar, please. You said four of the dragon balls were in one spot, right? Well then, it's possible that those guys... Uh, yeah, that explains it. They have the four dragon balls. Yeah, that's what I thought. Go on, did you feel it? Y yeah, their power was incredible. Whoa, Th that small guy, he, he might actually be stronger than Vegeta. Whoa, stronger than Vegeta? No way. Uh, cool, man. Wait, how are we supposed to get the Dragon Balls from those guys? Yes, this is the end uh, of the episode. I made a mistake uh, earlier saying that uh, this is actually the second episode. No, it is the first episode. So as you can see, we are in big trouble. I can't wait to, to play uh, the second episode. And uh, if you guys enjoyed uh, the, the walkthrough and uh, you want to see more Dragon Ball Z Kakarot uh, content, guides, uh, don't forget that you can subscribe uh, to this channel and also check the, the playlists uh, in the description. Uh, if you have questions, I'm waiting for them. I'll, uh, I always reply uh, to, to each, uh, each question and commentary. Thank you so much for, uh, for watching. I'm Vlad and I'll see you guys with the second episode of the second saga in Dragon Ball Z Kakarot.